have a letter from uh, Chris's sister, Sandra. It says, I loved you from the moment we brought you home. We fought the way brothers and sisters do growing up, but I always knew then, as I knew as an adult, that you always had my back. I could come to you with anything and feel your love and support. You never judged any decision I made, but always made sure I was okay. You put other people first. You were my hero. I marveled at your accomplishments as you joined the military and the police, fulfilling your dreams. I remember the day you picked out Michelle's engagement ring and how much fun we had as adults reminiscing about different events from our childhood. I celebrated your love for Michelle and your children and saw the pride you took in them every day. I will miss you every day for the rest of my life. We will forever mourn and we will never forget. I love you. Love, Sandra. And from Chris's mom, Barbara. Dearest Christopher, just last week, I wrapped my arms around you and told you goodbye and be safe when you came to say Happy Father's Day to Daddy. If I would have known that was the last time I would ever talk to you, I would never have let you go. I just want you to know you've been the best son anyone could ever ask for. I know that I told you countless times that I loved you and was proud you were my son. But I have never been prouder. You defended your country and the citizens of Haro and laid down your life to keep us safe. Godspeed. And I can't wait to see you again in heaven. <laughs> 